would really help us do the show if you'd put some pants on. <laughs> Thank you. It's beginning to look a lot like Christmas. With the horse and the skeleton and me. Is that one of the ones we were allowed to sing? Come on over, boy. No, I, I think we're going to get sued for that one. All right, well, what are the ones we were allowed to sing then? Oh, some classics. Right, well, what, what are they? Like, uh, <laughs> this is the actual list I was given. Oh, okay. Are you reading it in your it's mind? programmed into my system. Oh, okay, all right. Uh, Coventry Carol. What? Coventry Carol. I don't know that one. Exactly. All right. Uh, Dance of the Sugar Plum Fairy. I know that. Okay, okay, that's enough. We probably shouldn't do that either. What else? The Holly and the Ivy. Oh. <coughs> oh, man. <laughs> I'm sorry, I got some Holly and Ivy I stuck in my throat. I understand. I know that one, the Holly and the Ivy. Yeah, all right. All right, let's sing that one okay. then. Right, you ready? Yeah. The Holly and the Ivy. When there's a rider and there's a dizzy. The Holly and the crowd. The rising of the sun. Is that horse mocking me? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, let's do another one then, quickly. We don't have enough time. Okay, uh, I'm a little pine tree. I don't know that one. Let's, let's make up a tune for it. Okay. You start. Santa's got a bad foot. No, 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 you... Oh, 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 this, oh, oh, that one, all right. Santa's got a bad foot that's is my the name song. of a yeah. song? Yeah, it's a song, yeah. Let's sing that one. Then. All right, yeah. Santa's, Santa's got, got a bad foot. foot. He got no some bunions in his soap. Where he wears the boots and he went in the snow. And then things started to grow. And it was a big, horrible growth on his foot. And they had to amputate his leg. And that's, yeah, and that's, yeah. yeah. Time. We'll be right back, everybody. We'll be right back. Show with Craig Ferguson, sponsored by Macy's. Ladies and gentlemen, Craig Ferguson. Enough. Yes, it's okay. You have saved the job of the warm-up comedian for one more day. We call him a comedian. What is he? He's not really a comedian. Not really a no. comedian. No, he just frightens the studio audience into making a lot of noise like they're happy to be here. They're not happy to be here. <laughs> <laughs> it's a great day for America. That, no, not so much so. Not so much here in Los Angeles. Here in L.A., we have been struck by a disaster. A disaster called light rain. <laughs> we can't cope. The whole city is on lockdown. <laughs> We're officially on Stormwatch. We got the graphic for Stormwatch. Yeah! Wow. Yeah. What I... the hell, man? Thanks. <laughs> I, uh... I put on my sports bra for that, uh... 
It's very rainy here in L.A. today. So rainy. How, how, how rainy was it? Uh, it's it's so rainy that okay. people in Burbank took shelter under Jay Leno's chin. Not bad. Uh, <laughs> it's so rainy in L.A., the entire town smells like a wet Kardashian. <laughs> wow. Wow. It's so rainy, women in Beverly Hills injected themselves with float tox. <laughs> float, float. Float tox. All right, I get it. Yeah. It was so rainy in LA, Arnold Schwarzenegger decided to wear rubbers. There, I saw. Yeah, there you go. Oh, yeah. yeah. Ooh, me. Ooh, me. I'm the bad guy. That's right. <laughs> Oh, Craig, how could you? <laughs> it's my job. You get paid for this? Yeah. <laughs> anyway, it's a great day if you like Charles Dickens. And who doesn't? Who doesn't like to go to the library and grab a little Dickens? Because on this day... <laughs> <laughs> You're welcome, seventh graders. On this day... On this day in 1843, the Dickens classic, uh, uh, A Christmas Carol, was published. It was published on December 19th. That would never happen today. No. No, nah, it'd be out in July now. That's when they put the Christmas That's stuff right. out. That's right. Starbucks would have the old, old pumpkin breath blowing in. Pumpkin breath. Yeah, pumpkin breath. That's what happens. You go to Starbucks a little bit before Christmas and pumpkin, people eat pumpkins and then go, Yeah. Ah. They got a guy. They, they got a guy guys. that goes, Ah. Yeah. Into the air ducts. Yeah, that's right. It's just one guy. He sits up there. Yeah, he yeah. goes around all the Starbuckses. Uh, uh, I'm that guy. Oh, you, you do this on no, the side? No, no. Anyway, look, shut up. I'm talking about Christmas Carol. Now, we take it for granted now, but a Christmas Carol popularized a lot of phrases, uh, Christmas phrases like Merry Christmas. That's from a Christmas yeah. Carol. Uh, Scrooge. Bah humbug. Diam. <laughs> Is that, is that one? Yeah. That, that's one, too. Yeah, that's uh, Victorian Christmases. They used to go, damn! Yeah, all right. <laughs> damn, it's Christmas! I've never, never heard that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, like it, it, it's, well, this thing, uh, uh, a Christmas Carol, it's been adapted so many times. Uh, I love the Muppets one. That had Michael Caine as Scrooge. And at the end of it, he, well, I tell you what, you be the little boy okay, and I'll be right. Michael Caine. Okay, all right. At the end of the Scrooge okay. movie. All right, right, all right. You ready? Yeah. Oi, little boy, what day is it? Why, it's Christmas Day, sir. <laughs> now, you're wrong. This is the day that I shag Miss Piggy. <laughs> Come here, Miss Piggy. I'd, I'd quite like to see that, sir. No, no, you... <laughs> we've, no, we've changed our mind. <laughs> Shut up. Will you be doing it in the library, then? No, I'm going to Starbucks now and go... Ah. <laughs> OK, yeah. yeah. <laughs> There was a Disney version of A Christmas Carol, which was great, except that Scrooge is played by a duck. And at the end, Scrooge McDuck shows up at the Cratchit house with a giant cooked bird. <laughs> That's cannibalism! Yeah. yeah. Right? Yeah. Like, like, can you do the duck noise? With sure, it? sure. <laughs> right, right, yeah. Cannibalism. Then again, all bets are off when Scrooge's old partner was played by Goofy. No, oh, Hitler, better change your ways, bitch. Wow. I'll cut you. I'll cut you if you're not careful. He'll, oh, oh. He will cut you. He will cut you, Scrooge. Why don't you meet me in the library? We'll get crazy. No, no, no. I, I gotta go to Starbucks and uh, uh, uh. <laughs> the hell's going on? I don't know, man. <laughs> Anyway, not all of the Christmas Carol versions are good. Some are terrible, like the Arnold Schwarzenegger version was terrible. How did that one go again, Jeff? Hey, Timmy, you wouldn't be so tiny if you did push-ups, you Yeah, idiot. yeah, there you are. <laughs> <laughs> you know, of course, uh, the, if it's a famous work of literature, there has to be a porn version, oh, right? Yeah, oh, yeah, yeah, there would be a triple x with good old Ebenezer Screw. <laughs> and his catchphrase would be, ah, bum hug. <laughs> <laughs> Christmas is coming, Mr. Screw. Ah, bum hug. <laughs> and then he'd be very surprised when Tiny Tim turned into Enormous Tim. <laughs> enormous throbbing Tim. Charles Dickens, have you? Uh, there he is. Uh, that's his, quite a beard. That. That's why he was known as Lord Pubichin. Did you know that? That's true. That's true. 
Uh, Dickens wrote uh, dozens of classic words. Now, he got paid by the word. That's why his writing is so flowery. That's very good. Every, every word he got, you know, he wrote, he got an extra penny for or something. So he would have been like, Mr. Crumbledy Dumbledy went up the crickledy dickledy chairs. <laughs> now, nah, that's 18 shillings. Uh, and nah, then, nah. Tiny Tim was a criz wickety little boy whose leg was higgledy piggledy. <laughs> ka <-ching. laughs> That's, that's, that's me doing Dickens there, yeah, right? That's good. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> Do you know this is true? Dickens uh, did book readings to get publicity, and while he was reading a Christmas carol, he would throw rose petals into the crowd, thus starting the Victorian tradition of making it rain. Hey. Yeah, and he would make it rain, and people in the, the Dickensian, you know, Victorian people in the crowd would be like, damn! <laughs> and he would be like, no! Very accurate for Yeah, I'm, I'm painting a word picture for you here. Yeah, it's very accurate. That's all right. I'm done now. That's it. Okay. Yep, that's it. Ah, bum hug. <laughs> Come over here. I'll give you a... Yay. Yeah, uh, commercial break? Yeah, man. Why not? Let's do it. All right. More of Ye old Late Late Show with Gregory Fregley and Jeffrey Peggery after this. think of the holidays, what one word comes to mind? Sadomasochism. <laughs> what comes to mind for you, Friedrich Zegim? I'm reminded of the German word that means peace. And what word is that? Pumpenschreffen nach Laden eben Haus und Schnitzelbecken Hasselhoff Lachen Mode Boden the Buben. This brings a tear to my eye. <laughs> I think I'm sounding a bit like Dracula more and more, have you not? Know? <laughs> Man, you can't do you can't breathe in? No, I can't suck. <laughs> Stick around, I'll show you how. Yeah. Greg, what is that meant to mean? You know. <laughs> right? Yeah, you you know. <laughs> ah, I smell pumpkin. Yeah, exactly, yeah. right. <sighs> hey, what do you smell? <sighs> pumpkin? Yeah, all right. <laughs> <laughs> you're a filthy, now, filthy. Come on, man. Yeah, yeah, you're just filthy. You programmed me, man. You programmed me. No, I didn't. I can't program anything. I don't know how to work a... I was going to say iPhone, but I'm not allowed to say you iPhone. You can't say that, now. no. I can't program a phone. <laughs> or, a, or a tablet. Or a tablet, yeah. Phones and tablets. <laughs> Cheap bastards. You're a, you're a racist, man. Racist? Yeah. What time is it, Jeffrey Please. Pearson? It's Tweet Mail time, brought to you by a new holiday classic, Rob Ford, the Red-Nosed Mayor. Really? Yeah, look at that. Look at that. Wow. Look at that. That was... It's terrible. It's still clapped. Wow, man. That was like, that was like a joke. It was a something. joke, man. Did you write that down or something? Yeah. You, you programmed me. <laughs> no, you keep saying that. I didn't program you. I've never touched a single button on your body. Shut up. Shut <laughs> up. <laughs> All right, this is... Oh, we better do the jingle for the email. You ready? Oh, yeah, yeah. All right, then. Uh, all right, okay, you ready? I'll just... We'll do it ourselves. Okay, all right. All right. Jingle and then the holy lights tweet me. Santa's got a bad food. And he wants to be a smart girl. And he said, just let me the tweet. Do you know when I do that and close my eyes? It's great fun. 
You like that, huh? You like yeah. that? Just hovering, just hovering. <laughs> yeah. It seems like they make a different sound. One goes, and one goes, it's like they're a slightly different size. Of course, that would, <laughs> of course, that would never, of course, that would never happen. <laughs> All right. Um, this is from Diz in New York City. I don't know if you can tell, but Diz is two penguins. Uh, one's a slightly different size. Oh, wow. Hmm. Uh, Diz says, uh, Craig, I noticed that uh, you, Jeff, and Secretariat have stockings hung by the chimney with care. But where is Alfredo's stocking? That's true. Alfredo is the leader of our band, Alfredo Sauce and the Shy Fellas. Yeah. The shyest band in late night. How are you doing tonight, guys? Hey, good. How are you doing, man? <laughs> All right. Let's hear some music. Yeah. One, two, one. Here we go. Well, how come you don't have any uh, stockings hanging up by the fire? Oh, we're too shy. We're too shy. Do you have stockings hanging up back there? Oh, we got stockings hanging off our junk. <laughs> we're all naked back here. We're all naked. Oh, uh, okay. Thanks, man. Hey, smell my breath. No, no, shut up. I, I liked it better when you were shy. Are you... I can smell pumpkin. What are you doing? It's a working. It's a working. <laughs> what the hell, man? I don't know, man. Awkward. This is from Jamie in Detroit, Michigan. You ever been there? Good place. Love oh, Detroit. Oh, I tell you what I enjoy there. What do you like? Well, there? you tell me first. Oh, I like the streets. Yeah. <laughs> uh, hi, Craig and Jeff. Will you two be hanging out together on Christmas morning? <laughs> <laughs> no. This is from Alexandra in Mississauga in Ontario. This is uh, Canada. Mississauga, yeah. Mississauga. Hello, Craig, Jeff, Secretary, and Alfredo. You get mentioned now. Oh, this is Craig. Hello. <laughs> uh, are the Shy Fellas performing anywhere this weekend? I have time off and a free airplane ticket. Well, uh, are you going anywhere this weekend? Yes, we're going to be in uh, Sacramento. Sacramento? <laughs> really? Sacramento, you yeah. say? Uh, where are you playing in Sacramento? It's a convention. It's a, a <laughs> convention of uh, pumpkin breeders. <laughs> pumpkin breeders or pumpkin breathers? Both. They also breed the pumpkin, too. Yeah, whatever you want. <laughs> Is the whole band going or just you? Afraid? Everybody. All the guys going to be there. Uh, who are all the guys again? Uh, Nikki D's going to be there. Hi, guy. I mean, oh, hi. <laughs> Nikki D on drums here. I'll be there. Uh-huh. Who else is there? Uh, Terry Slaps on bass. How you doing? <laughs> uh, anyone else? Uh, Joey Turnips. I play ocarina. <laughs> ocarina? I'm not familiar with that instrument. Can I hear it? Yeah, the ocarina. Yeah, let me... Hold on a second. I... <laughs> <laughs> wow. You're quite the ocarina. Or... What the hell is happening? I don't know, man. <laughs> What I like is this, every time I talk to the band, they take a shot of the curtain. That's what I like. Yeah, I like that. <laughs> uh, I know we're out of time. Just one more, all right? All right. Uh, that's, uh, this is from Matt in Atlanta, Georgia. He says, uh, Craig, I'm going to London for the first time. Any tips on talking to English women? Yes. Uh, talk like this. That's good. Yeah, or, or talk like this. You yeah, well, that. that's right. If Very you're wrong. in London, yeah, yeah. all right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> and if you hear this sound, you're doing well. <laughs> and if you hear this sound, get out of town. I don't know what I meant by that. I don't either. <laughs> All right, we're, let's take a commercial break. Wow. Oh, hurry up. Evening. <laughs> Thanks, everybody. My first guest this evening is an Oscar winning actor. You can see him in Lee Daniels' The Butler, which is in theaters now and on DVD on January the 14th. Take a look at this. Cuba Gooding Jr. Mr. 
Mr. Gooding Jr. Oh, you threw out the confetti for Yeah, us, I did. It's I very like nice. That. You look great, man. You Thank look like, you. You're in terrific shape. Are you eating a lot of kale? Is I'm eating a lot on? of kale. <laughs> what, a black man can't have kale? No, of course a black man can have kale. Well, that's one of the uh, foods that I enjoy too. It makes yeah. us all. I don't. I've never had it. I don't think. You ever had it? I've never had kale in my damn life. <laughs> well, well my wife actually, my wife uh, uh, chose to be a vegetarian. She jumped into the vegetarian thing. Oh. So she's getting me and the kids to eat a lot more kale to keep us regular. <laughs> Cause she knows she married a crazy tutti fruits. Yeah. <clears throat> Can you say that? Yeah, you You're a did. racist, man. <laughs> what did he say? Oh, it was just a matter of time, yeah. right? Just a matter I, of time. I knew it. I knew it. So, uh, listen, do you play ice hockey? Phil in the office says yeah. you play, play ice hockey. He's I, in this I ice do. hockey I thing. I play twice a week with uh, Jerry Brookheimer's crew and a few other guys. Uh, we, we have tournaments in Miami and, uh, and uh, Vegas. He says you're pretty good. You know what's so funny? I always say that nobody mentions the fact that I play in Miami and Vegas ice hockey. <laughs> oh, all right, let me, nobody, give, me give me a chance. Nobody, Miami and Vegas? Yeah. It's a whole lot of snow in Miami and Vegas. <laughs> oh, you're crazy. Oh, you slow some of bitch. <laughs> I was trying to get you to help me to get in trouble with the wife because there's nothing but bikinis at Vegas. Oh, and Miami, I, I see. Ice hockey. Yeah, yeah. You I know, the more I teach you to dumb, I get, Craig. <laughs> I can't keep up. It's like the whole show is being taped in reverse order. What? Nice cut. Thanks. I'm going to talk about it later on. <laughs> That's a nice cut. Thank you. I didn't. I didn't know they made doo doo cups. Is that a is that a pile of doo doo? No, it's a snake, man. <laughs> It was a pile of doo doo. Now dude, come on now. Dude, dude, that looked like you cut the top off the pile and put a penis on the side. <laughs> Tell the truth. Oh no, it's got fangs. No. Yeah. It's okay. All right. No, I, I cut the top off a pile and put a penis on the side. I like how you gave it one gold tooth. So that's a black snake. No, it, it's just had a little dental work. Uh, somebody here uh, broke the snake. I can't remember. Oh, I Don't touch it. All right. Yes, All right. <laughs> So congratulations on this movie. It's a big hit. Yeah, you, you, I mean, it's like, you know, the old, Oprah's there. Oprah Winfrey, yeah. Forrest Whitaker, Vanessa Redgrave. Yeah, yeah, yeah. A lot of good people. That Oprah, man. She's she, rich. She is. <laughs> not only is she rich, but she smells like, smells. Money. She just, she's a beautiful smell. Yeah, she's beautiful. She yeah. has a beautiful smell, and she knows exactly what sh people do when she comes into a room and she knows how to diffuse it and make you just feel at home. She, she knows, really actually, the thing about Oprah um, is she knows yeah. what you're doing. <laughs> <laughs> she actually worked for the CIA, actually. They work for her, I yeah. think that's what it is. <laughs> Yeah, that's good, though. I can't believe it, that the ice hockey thing, because Phil from yeah. the office, he says you're really good, man. You're yeah, I've been like, playing a long time now, 20-something yeah. years, yeah. you know? I mean, if you think about it, there's not many things other than the puck that are black on the ice that move that fast. <laughs> so... <laughs> so you have to learn how to skate your ass off just to compete. Because they will slap you into the net if you don't move fast enough. I, I don't know what I'm talking about. Well, that's all right. <laughs> I, I occasionally go and watch a little bit of ice No, it's the, be it's the best. How did you get into it? Was it was I just, I, I joined a pickup league and I realized, you know, because playing football when I grew up, right. I was a wide receiver, you know, and I always had the, the moves. And so when you get on the ice with the puck, it's the same thing. You know, you got to keep your legs moving and isolate your, your, your upper half from your bottom half to, to move the puck and then... You know, hand-eye coordination. It's a, it's a lot of the same principles. Yeah, That's it's, why I fell in love. Yeah, it's too much work for me, man. I, uh, <laughs> I can't eat that much kale. <laughs> a little golf. A little golf. You play any golf? Uh, no, no. Oh, I come on, man. Not as much. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Golf's good. You, are you a good golfer? I just started. I just started. I started when I was 50 years old. I'm 51 now. I started playing golf. Is that true? Yeah, yeah. I was... What made you pick up golf? Because you have that much money now? Yeah. <laughs> I can afford a golf club. Not, not a club. A, yeah, an actual like a club, not a membership of one. Just, you know, a, a club. Oh, a club. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> okay. I can't afford like, hockey stuff like you. There's a lot of padding and stuff. You have to wear that giant thing in front of your junk. <laughs>
<laughs> it's actually shorts that go past your knees, and there's a bunch of pads that go and protect your butt and everything. Yeah, yeah. I, I wear that sometimes. <laughs> but just I, around the house? Yeah, yeah, just around the house. <laughs> yeah, and I, I walk around where and just eat kale. Oh, is that right? Yeah, yeah, I walk around wearing that, nothing else, and I eat kale, and I'm like, yeah! <laughs> That's a visual. I'll All right, yeah. yeah, yeah. <laughs> what else is going on with you? What are you doing? You making some more films? And uh, you, you know, I'm just uh, kind of chilling. Okay. You know, I'm here on the Craig Ferguson show, just chilling with a, with a skeleton, with a sick. <laughs> what is that thing over there? Craig? Hey, hey, man, hey, don't talk about it. Jeff. Well, come on. Miami man. and Vegas? You kidding me? There's no ice there. Yeah, there you there, see, that's where you should have put it. I get it now. Yeah. I get it now. That's what makes me yeah. look good. Let me guess. The brains and the humor. <laughs> you were going to say the beauty, and then you realized you couldn't, right? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> no, th this is the uh, brains, uh, yeah. this is the beauty, and this is the uh, foreigner. <laughs> that's a hell of a trio. Yeah. You got Rudolph. How'd you get the lipsticks on Rudolph over there with the eyelashes? That's a horse. His name is Secretaria, and he's wearing the antlers for Christmas. I was gonna say that, was, that horses don't have antlers. That's there's costume. Yeah, a horse can wear a what? Well, a horse can't wear a costume now. <laughs> oh, a horse can't wear a costume. I'm not You're a racist, I'm man. Not racist You're a racist. I'm not racist profile. No, I'm, I'm just saying. saying. A I'm horse saying. can't wear a costume. From over here. Ooh la la. Look like. Rudolph with the red nose and the rain. Yeah, that's because he's wearing a costume to look like Rudolph. I see. I only saw the front half. The back half's probably got a nice little tail on it. Well, and he can get it. Look. Oh. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. 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 That horse has got a hell of a future behind it. Yeah, no. That's the intern program for you. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> Well, I started out as the horse's ass on a late night TV show. Uh, all right, well, we're out of time. That's it. We're done. That's it. Yeah, we're done. Wow. Yeah, what are you doing for Christmas? Um, I'm just going to jail my son. My oldest son went off to college and he's home. Ooh, whoa, boy. For a few weeks. So, you bring uh, the laundry with him? Yeah. Yeah. yeah, yeah. That's hysterical. Yeah, 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 yeah. Extra, got to pay extra baggage just so he can bring home dirty drawers. Yeah. yeah. That's a big deal. Is that your first kid going to college? Yeah, first one. Oh, man. Yeah. How you doing? The first get good. I cried like a little bitch. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> but uh, I'm better about myself now. Now that he's home, I understand how nice it was when his ass was away. <laughs> <laughs> Give a game, Jay. Craft Ralph, when you think of the holidays, what one word comes to mind? Sadomasochism. <laughs> <laughs> what comes to mind for you? Three tickets to game? That's a question to me. That's... Oh, sorry. <laughs> I see. <laughs> <laughs> it's like this. What comes to mind for you? Free drinks to give. <laughs> oh, I thought I was unprepared. <laughs> <laughs> Because I've already had a guest, of course. <laughs> this is easy. <laughs> Welcome back, everyone. My next guest is a beautiful actress who stars on NCIS, which airs uh, Tuesday nights at 8 o'clock on CBS. Take a look at this. <laughs> Emily Wickersham, everybody. Emily Wickersham. Great. I 
love this Thank orange. You. It's lovely. I am wearing color I don't normally. Yeah, well, it's fantastic. It really works for you. Well, You're very you. so bright and juicy and fresh. Happy. Thank you very much. Well, it's an orange. <laughs> it, it is it is an orange. It's, it's a juicy it's a juicy orange. A juicy orange. A juicy orange. Um <laughs> Can I say, I'm, I suppose people say this to you all the time, your name sounds very English, doesn't it? It is English. Oh, well, I imagine it probably is. I am not. You, no, you don't. No, I no. Didn't, no, mm. no. No, I don't have that. What? Uh, You've got teeth? I've got teeth. Yes. I've, I have got teeth. This? I don't have the accent. Well, I think you should, you'd be jolly good at it, though. Like Emily Wickersham. Hello, Emily Wickersham. It'd be lovely. Yes, it would. Yes, it would be very nice. All you have to do is yes. just go like this. It was fine. <laughs> Do you watch Downton Abbey? I love Downton Abbey. Well, there you are then. You could I, be in it as well, Emily Wickersham. I should. You know, I'm going to talk to them about that. You should. I will. Um, Wickersham is English. I'm Austrian and Swedish. Born in Kansas. Oh. Yeah, yeah. Oh, and the, I, I found out only recently, about a month ago, that Wickersham, there are Wickersham brothers in a Dr. Seuss book. Are there? Mm -hmm. Wh which one? There, there are three. I don't know. Okay. But there, there are three. Is it the blue? Lorax? Because that could be quite Lorax. Your dress is quite Lorax. It, it is maybe so. Yeah. Maybe so. Um, I don't know any. Uh, Jeff, you know about Dr. Seuss, uh, uh, Wickersham Brothers. Yeah, the Wicker. I'm not familiar. I'm very confused by this. Oh. Yeah. Well, I've only recently learned about them. I think somebody might be making it up to get your attention, Emily. No, I googled it. I actually. Oh well, that it. means it's yes, true. Yes, yeah, it's true. Yeah, it's true. It's on Google. True. No, nah, it means it's true. Yeah. Do you like snakes? Uh, I like to look at them. I don't like to have them on me. Well, neither do I. Do you... <laughs> well, that's a, what a ridiculous thing to say. That's like, do you like cats? <laughs> yes, I like cats, but I don't want to have uh, them on you, me. So you, li you obviously like snakes. I, I like, I, I like, I like them in cup form. In mug form yeah, only. Yeah. Only. Yeah, I don't, I don't want snakes on right, me. Right, 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 right. Of course, of course. Have you ever had a snake on you? Um, no. Well, how do you know you don't like it? I, then? I don't think, I don't think it's the slivery. Yeah, no, they're, you know yeah, I mean? no, they're a bit, yeah, oh, yeah. yeah. Well, and if you're it might be nice as a scarf. It would just lay there, maybe. It, I don't know. It's a wild animal. It might not just lay there. It, it, might, could, it could sliver it around. It might leave. It might do a poop on you. It true, might... true, 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 true. No, no, you definitely won't want a poop on do, you. Do, do, you have, do you have any pets? I have two dogs. I mm -hmm. have two dogs, and they would like Are they me. English? Uh, they are, um, no, they're not. Are they Austrian and Swedish and from Kansas? Exactly, they are, yes. What kind yes, of dogs yes. are they? Chihuahua mix and a Chow Shepherd mix. Oh. Do you have pets? I do. I have three. Oh, you do? Three and... dogs, yes. A, a German Shepherd who talks like this. Uh, yeah. Marches uh, up uh, and down. Uh, Jack Russell, uh -huh. which is Irish, uh -huh. drunk all the time. Right, right. Of uh, course, of course. And a uh, French bulldog which has uh, ennui and smokes. Oh. <laughs> three, three big personalities. Yeah, yeah. They're yeah. very, very different. Uh, do you, you always grew up with dogs? Uh, you know, actually, I was telling someone this the other day. My first memory is uh, I was on the kitchen counter in, in Kansas, and I was looking down at my, my huge dog. It was like this massive, massive dog, and I, have, I was frightened. Why were you on the kitchen counter? Were people pre preparing to no, eat you? No, I, I don't <coughs> know. You shouldn't be up there. I should ask you? my parents Yeah, that. yeah, yeah be, that's should. bad parenting. That is. Yeah. I was just up there by I'm not, myself. I'm not judging your parents in any way, no, no, but no. I'm saying they're bad parents. <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm sure they're great parents, but then they again, they left a baby on top of the uh, kitchen counter. I don't know what they were doing. Yeah, there's, there could be anything there. Are your family vegetarians? Uh, no, no, they're not. Well, they're... So they were probably going to eat me. Yeah, well, <laughs> <laughs> that's, that's the first clue. That is the first clue. Are you a vegetarian? <laughs> I am a vegetarian. I knew you would be. How did you know that? Well, you're an actress. Uh, are yeah. all, all actresses vegetarian? They are? Many, many actresses. I mean, it's a kind of 50 50 shot, really. Uh, nice. Yeah, yeah. Well, and, you know, I it's just, all right. You, I mean, you got to you know, look good, so you got to eat healthy you and all that stuff. You got to eat yeah. your greens. Only two years in. You're only two years into yeah, vegetarianism? Yeah, yeah. Well, you, you could get out then, probably still. I, I, I could get out. I could start you, eating You still not again. had your finals. No, 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 right, no. Exactly, okay. exactly. Now, are you very strict? Do you do the... Are, are you a vegan or are you just... Um... And no, I don't have much dairy. Right. Um, yeah. I don't and have... your folks are from Kansas. They're from Kansas. You don't Kansas. have dairy or, or meat. I, I know. Them, Coming please. from Kansas, you would think I, I would be... I'd have thought you'd have been a cowboy that milk. enjoyed meat. I know. When I was younger, I did. Yeah. It's an L.A. thing. Who knows? I don't know. It might be. Do you enjoy kale? I do love kale. You know, it's funny. Cuba Gooding Jr. was just here earlier on, and he was talking. Mm, mm, he was see. talking about whether or not he liked kale. Oh. <laughs> Can you explain? 
explain? Can you explain to me? Can you explain to me exactly what kale is? It's a cabbage of sorts. You know, it's a lettuce of sorts. Right. Um, it's a dark green lettuce of sorts. Well, lettuce should be light green. Lettuce. Sh should it be light green? I would, I would think so, yeah. Really? Huh. Yeah, I mean, English lettuce, absolutely. Well... Dark green lettuce uh, implies a lettuce of some uh, morbidity. Uh, that is true. I will not be eating kale anymore no, from no, now on. It, nope. it, it'll probably, no, it is, people do it, love kale. They say it's a superfood, it, it like is blueberries. A superfood. It is, it is. Right. A lot of snakes are dark green. They might be made of kale. <laughs> Still wouldn't want one on me. Mm. Yeah. No, me neither. Me neither. I have a story about this mug. This mug? Mm-hmm. My, yeah. um, well, yes. This is Mary McCormick gave you this mug? Yes, Mary, my friend Mary McCormick. Do you my, know Mary? Well, I, it's funny. I don't know Mary. Okay. But my parents live next to her parents in New York. Okay. And I have been meaning to meet Mary. And my brother was like, I think Mary McCormick gave Craig that snake mug. She did. It's Mary, very, it's Mary's very my cool. friend. Mary's very lovely. I would but like... But she's not a vegetarian. Oh. <laughs> you serve she's... her salad, she will cut up it. She will... <laughs> <laughs> you better... She... I don't know. She might be a vegetarian now, Mary. I don't, I don't think so, though. Mm, I don't know. I'll, yeah. I'll ask her mom. Yeah, yeah. yeah it's... I, just, I talk to her mom, not her. You, really? Yes. Well, tell yeah. her mom hi from me. I will, I will. I've never met her mom. She's very Unless sweet. I have, in very which case sweet. I'll feel like such a fool. <laughs> <laughs> no, I haven't. I haven't met uh, Mary's mom. Mm -hmm. Well, you should meet Mary. She's lovely. I, I, she doesn't I give cups like to everybody, you know. No, I, I don't think I will get a cup right away. Well, you wouldn't want what? You know, you have to work up to the cup. But I don't know if I would want a snake cup. Well, you... I would want maybe a, a, a dog. Dog cup? A dog. Maybe I've got a, some dog cups lizard. in the house, but I don't care for them. Oh. Well, the, it's just the dog's head. They're very hard to hold. The tail comes yeah. off too far. The tail comes off the bit. other yeah. end. Yeah, yeah, and, no, you know. I totally understand. Totally well, understand. Well, I think we are. Oh, by the way, well mm. done in uh, NC... Uh, what is it? <laughs> yeah, one of those. CSI one of those. Miami? One of those, now, yeah. It's NCIS, isn't it? That's, <laughs> it is. that's the good one. It is, it is. <laughs> but well Thank done. You. Well Thanks. done on that show, because that's my favourite. Thanks. Yeah. Is it? Look, you know what? You're doing well. You're on a big hit TV show. Thank Good you. for you. Thanks. Emily Wickersham, everybody. <laughs>